take a cinnamon roll. These are the grand cinnamon rolls. I'm smushing it out with my fingers. Don't come at me in the comments. I washed my hands. And then we're going to add some thin sliced apples and then another cinnamon roll on top. So we're essentially making an apple cinnamon roll sandwich. And then I'm going to press it into my waffle iron. Within a few minutes, you've got a delicious sandwich. It's more like a panini, apple cinnamon roll panini. And then I'm going to add some caramel sauce. I'm using the sugar-free just because it's less calories, makes it lighter and healthier. And don't forget to let it cool because you will burn your mouth if you dive right in. Now, those cinnamon rolls come with icing, so we're adding that on top as well. And it's time to taste test. Y'all, this was so good. You have to try it. Waffle irons are not just for waffles. You can put so many things in there. In fact, what should I put in my waffle iron next? Let me know in the comments.